So this right here is the Xiaomi AX3000 Wi-Fi 6 mesh system. So here's the deal. A lot of you guys who've signed up to internet service providers have been shipped a really box standard modem that only really uses 2.4 gigahertz and five gigahertz bands. And those modems are pretty good. But here's the problem. If you're quite far away from the modem, your devices will default to the 2.4 gigahertz band, which can be painfully slow in some scenarios. But in the best case scenario, if you're right next to the modem itself, you'll likely get the five gigahertz bandwidth, which is the faster form of Wi-Fi. But this product right here, the AX3000 from Xiaomi, supports the next generation in Wi-Fi, which is Wi-Fi 6. It's faster, even at longer distances. And the great thing about this setup is we've got two satellites, which means you can have one right next to your modem. You literally just plug it into your existing modem. And then the other one can be in an area of your house where you get slower Wi-Fi signals and it will act as a relay. So for the sake of authenticity, I will tell you guys right now, I have no idea how much of a difference this mesh system is gonna make to my internet speeds. So what I'm gonna show you guys is a before and after of the speeds here in my YouTube studio. So check this out. So here we go, here's the speeds I'm getting from my default modem from my ISP. And this is probably the furthest point inside the house away from the modem. And you can see the speeds here on the iPhone are diabolical. And this right here is the Xiaomi Mi 11T Pro. Let's see if this is any better. So I think you'll agree, those speeds are pretty dreadful. And trust me, those are the legit speeds that I get in this room without any routers or extenders or anything like that. Now let's see what kind of a difference the Xiaomi AX3000 will make. Okay, so I'm right next to where my modem is now. It's in this drawer, the drawer of doom. Check this out. It's just in there. And that's probably why the signal is pretty bad upstairs because it's blocked by a bunch of stuff, including a bunch of electronics over here. And just to show you what the speeds should actually be like and what I'm actually paying for, let's run another speed test here, right next to the modem. So I'm actually really disappointed because I'm paying for 200 megs download speed and I'm not even getting that with the iPhone right next to the modem. Let's set up the Xiaomi AX3000 now, see if that makes a difference. And it was only at this point I realized that if this doesn't work, I had just wasted half of my day making this video. So I've just finished setting up the Xiaomi AX3000 mesh system and it was pretty straightforward. Download the Xiaomi Home app, follow the instructions on screen, plug it in to the existing router and that is pretty much it. And I know some of you guys might think, if I change my modem, that means I'm gonna have to change the logins for all of my smart home devices, TVs, vacuums, light bulbs, everything. Well, actually, you don't need to do this. Here's a little ninja tip for you. Set up the same SSID and same network password and everything will just connect again automatically like it was the same hardware you were using before. And here's a little side note. I really do like the look of the mesh system here. They kind of look like speakers. There's no over the top branding on them or anything like that. Just a couple of LED lights and they kind of look like a bit of tech that you'd find on the Star Wars Death Star. Now let's connect to the Wi-Fi 6 modem. And we're gonna run the test again, same app. All right, so I'm back upstairs now and I've set up the mesh hub right behind me here. So this room should now have proper Wi-Fi coverage and not just any Wi-Fi coverage, we should have Wi-Fi 6 speeds upstairs. So first off, let's test the iPhone. Wait a minute, that's still connected to the old Wi-Fi. Let me connect to the new Wi-Fi. Okay, let's try that again on the new network. So 
So that was the iPhone. Let's try the Xiaomi phone now and see if that's even better. So honestly, when I started off making this video, I had no idea how good these results were gonna turn out to be. And there's a few reasons why we're getting these incredible speeds here. This router actually has dual band technology and it supports the 160 megahertz bandwidth, the Wi-Fi 6 range, and it can use the five gigahertz frequency band to double the speeds compared to more traditional Wi-Fi 6 routers. And on top of that, we've also got a Qualcomm processor inside with 256 megabytes of RAM. And a lot of people don't realize that modems have to be quite smart to handle all of your smart devices because a lot of people these days will have so many light bulbs, so many TVs, Hoovers, loads of other kind of smart home stuff. If you don't have a powerful chip inside your router, it could struggle to manage all of those devices. And so for that reason, we have a tri-core Qualcomm processor inside. And the AX3000 also supports OFDMA technology, which improves the performance and reduces latency so all of your devices can get the best speeds. And it also brings improved security as well because they have WPA3 technology, which enhances all of the security of your network. And all of this whilst reducing power consumption. And here's one of the most important things about this setup is if you have an Xbox Series S or a PlayStation 5, those devices support Wi-Fi 6. So actually you'll be good without a wire on those games consoles. So if you are a gamer, you need to step up your router game and get one of these. And the great thing about the AX3000 is it isn't that expensive. Xiaomi do have a more expensive AX9000, but this one right here for the price it comes in at is definitely a recommended product by me. I had faith that these products would deliver. And after running this little experiment in this video, I'm glad that it did meet my expectations. And actually it surpassed them by a lot. You saw it for yourself. The speed difference is incredible compared to the stock modem that I was given. And if it worked for me, it can work for you too. Go check it out, link below the video. I appreciate you guys for watching this one. If you enjoyed it, thumbs up and subscribe would be amazing. Appreciate you guys, see you in the next one.